Hey guys, BFQ here. Um, I'm here today with a collective haul for you guys. Um, I've done not a whole lot of shopping, um, but I will be featuring clothes and shoes in this particular video. And I also bought some um, makeup. So I just wanted to come and share that with you guys. Um, and let's just get some... Um, go ahead and get into some of the sleek cosmetics products that I purchased um, this is my first purchase from sleek uh, and I'm actually very impressed with the items that I bought I've been using them like crazy first ever first since the first thing I got was my I Divine palette in Au Natural. And everything came so neatly packaged, but this is the box that it actually comes in. And the palette itself is black. And it just says sleek on the front. And this palette has... 12 colors and of course it comes like this it has a really huge mirror on the bottom so I'm just going to cover that up but um, it comes with the 12 colors and this all neutral colors let me just take this the protective film cover off but it looks like that And it does, it has a really wide mirror on this end. Um, I love this palette. I, I've used it like two or three times since I've had it. Um, and they're really nice pigmented colors. Just Those are just three random shades right there. But they're really nice. I also got a blush and these tend to look a little bigger um, online and you know what I'm saying like when you may watch some of you know people's videos but it looks it's actually really small um, but it comes like this and I got rose gold and it comes with a little mirror on one side and this is what it looks like. It's really, really pretty on. It looks like that on the skin. I'm really impressed with Sleek. They, um, I believe they're very brown girl friendly. So, I'm loving that. I also got the Contour... Um, and highlight kit and this one is in medium so that's the box it comes in let me open this for you and then it looks like that and see that in comparison to the blush like it's so the blush is teeny compared to that yeah they come in light medium and dark and I got medium and it has a mirror on this end and then this is the contour shade and the highlight shade. And the highlight shade is completely gorgeous. Like, when you put it on, it's so pretty. I'm in love with this. Like, I absolutely love it. And then I got um, this cream to powder uh, foundation kit it came in a box like that and this is from light to medium and it looks like that and it comes with five different shades and I don't know which one is supposed to be the lightest but they all kind of look you know like a light brown I use it for highlight that's what I got it for as you can tell I've I already used that one, but um, 
I just thought that it was interesting. I had a couple of kits like this before that I got from Sasha Cosmetics. Um, and those have lasted me a really long time. I still have those. I keep those in my makeup kit because you never know, you know, what kind of clientele you'll have or, you know, what shades you may need or whatever. And that was all I purchased from Sleek. And they're really, um, not necessarily cheap, but, um, they're, they're really nicely priced. I think for all four of these plus shipping, I think I paid like 32 bucks. So, that was that. So, next I have some stuff that I purchased from e.l.f. And, um, of course, as you may know or you may not know, e.l.f. has a... They've really been kind of like perfecting their studio line of stuff. And if you're not familiar with what the studio line is, those are like the... Um, like the black brushes that you can buy. I believe they do sell them at Target. Um, but I order. See, I'm the type of person, if I don't have to go to a store, I'm totally fine with that. I'll order it quick, fast, and in a hurry and just wait for it to get here. Bought another one of these, the powder brush from e.l.f. It's the kind with the flat top. I use that. I'm When I say I'm in love with this brush, absolutely in love with this brush. It's the flat top kind. And I use it to put my um, foundation on. So I got another one of these. This will make number three. Um, I have one for me. And one I keep in my kit. And then this one is, I guess it's just a backup one. <laughs> but I absolutely love it. So I just went on ahead and got another one. So that was that. I also bought a um, an angled blush brush. And it looks like this. And I plan on using it for um, when I do my contour. Because uh, the previous brush I had, my son broke. And I needed a new one. It wasn't one of these. It was um, one I think I got from like CVS or something. I think it was like Essence of Beauty or something. But um, it's broke. And RIP to that brush. So... And then I also got the small stipple brush. It's the dual fiber one. Um, I have the big one like this. And it just looks like it's pretty much the same thing. It's just a small one. And I use this to apply my highlight. It's really good for that. So that's why I got this. I, had, I bought two of these as well. I used one already. So this one will go in my, my kit for clients. And this one was three bucks as well. I love Elf's brushes. Their studio line. I love their brushes. So I got that. Went on ahead and purchased two of their contour and bronzing blush and powder set thingamajig. Looks like that. This one is Antigua. And this is the packaging that it comes in. And it's really... um. These are really brown girl friendly too. At least the two shades that I got. And it looks like this. The package looks like this. And then it's got a really huge mirror on this end. And then the blushes look like this. This is the contour shade of course. And this is the blush. And this blush is really like a, um, a real bubblegum pink. I really like it. It's cute. And then, I have the other one. This one is Turks and Caicos. And it's almost the same as that one, but this one is more of a rosy pink. It's not bubblegum pink. Now, I have used this one. Looks like that, of course. And it has the big mirror. And looks like this. And I, um, I use the blush. Actually, you can use it as a highlight. It does really good as a highlight. Because it, it kind of gives off a, a goldy effect. Let's see. It's 
kind of like a dusty mauve type color probably can't see it too well but it is it's right there I used it as a highlight but um yeah I'm thoroughly impressed with these kudos shout out to elf do your thing I also got now I've never used anything like this before um I got one of their HD new the blushes this is new and this is in showstopper and when I say that I love this color it's such a must have for fall if I can get it out and the packaging is so cute it's so sleek and little like that and it's picking up kind of dark but it's a really pretty um I guess like a maroon purple type color and it comes with a little pump thing and you don't need a whole lot that is the dot that I squoze out of here so just look at what all it gives off It doesn't take much at all that is the actual color of the blush love that I want to say these were three dollars too anywhere between three and five but I think it was three so yeah and I believe it had they have like five I think they have like five different shades of the different um, the HD blushes uh, I just ordered two more I believe it's encore and I think it's called Diva or something like that. But when they get here, I'll share those with you guys as well. So that pretty much concludes the haul. I told you I didn't have much. I just wanted to come share. And um, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. BFQ out.